next question comes from Kat E. Klein, who asks, How did you find out you had VWD? Well, it's actually an interesting story. When we were little, we would both get these massive nosebleeds that would take forever to stop bleeding, and they would happen all the time. Sorry. Go ahead. And our parents were a little concerned, but they thought that maybe it was due to the dry air in the room. So we, we had this massively loud humidifier that would make this like sound that was so annoying and oops, sorry. Anyway, it wasn't until last winter after this huge snowstorm. Rachel and I went sledding with some friends and everything was great. But on one of the last rides down, we all decided to pile into one sled. Me, Rachel, our friend Sarah, and our other friend Reese. And as we went down, we started to catch some speed. When suddenly, out of nowhere, we hit this huge snow ramp and- And we all went flying in the air. It was chaos. It was madness. It was awesome. Until it wasn't, because Riley actually got pretty hurt. She had this huge raised bruise. I mean, it was massive and bumpy, and it was so gross, but also, like, cool at the same time, and- Rachel! Would you like to finish the story? No, no. You go ahead. So, yeah. Anyway. I had this huge raised bruise that wasn't healing. And between that and our frequent nosebleeds, our doctor suggested we go to the children's hospital for more tests. And that's when we, we found out we had Von Willebrand disease. <sighs> yeah. And it kind of made sense because our grandma and aunts also have it. It's a genetic thing. <laughs> 